हेलो स्टूडेंट नाउ विल सी इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ एडीसी बेसिकली एडीसी कन्वर्ट्स आर मोस्टली यूज्ड डिवाइस फॉर डेटा एक्विजिशन व्हाट इज मीन बाय डेटा एक्विजिशन इट इज सिग्नल कन्वर्जन मेक इट अंडरस्टेबल टू माइक्रो कंट्रोलर और माइक्रो प्रोसेसर वी एवरी वन नोज कंप्यूटर यूज बाइनरी वैल्यू बट इन फिजिकल वर्ल्ड एवरी थिंग इज एनोलॉग इन फिजिकल वर्ल्ड मीन्स वॉट लाइक इन अराउंड टेम्परेचर प्रेशर ह्यूमिडिटी लाइट फोर्स these are the physical quantities which are having analog values like temperature it's degree celsius or fahrenheit light we measure in lux then pressure is in pascal or kilopascal then force kg or kilonewton so these physical quantity is converted to electrical signal using device called transducer we everyone know this transducer is nothing but sensor this sensor converts electrical signal this sensors converts physical quantity into electrical signals example voltage current or resistance for example temperature sensor it converts temperature into either in voltage or in resistance like pressure sensor it converts pressure kilopascal into some millivolt light lux the output is in the form of either resistance we know ldr light dependent resistor then it converts light into current it convert light into voltage so we need a analog to digital converter to translate analog signal to digital number so that microcontroller can read and process see these all physical quantities come with analog value but we know microcontroller or microprocessor knows binary value or digital value so make it understandable we have to convert first this analog value into digital value and again for the display we have to convert that digital value into analog value in some of the microcontroller the manufacturer are not given adc inbuilt what is mean adc inbuilt the adc configuration is inbuilt itself but some microcontrollers are not coming with inbuilt adc we have to connect external ic to microcontroller or microprocessor like 0808 it is adc external adc ic we have to interface this adc with microcontroller but in peak microcontroller we are having 10 bit inbuilt adc types of adc in our digital electronics subject we have already studied these a to d converters flash 82 converters successive approximation converters we abbreviated as a sar successive approximation examples of successive approximations are dual slope and delta sigma we are not going to deep into this topic then an adc converts a continuous time and continuous amplitude analog signal to discrete time and discrete amplitude digital signal how here 
one block diagram is there. This is sample and whole circuit. This is sample and whole circuit. Why it is called as a sample and whole circuit? Because it samples the signal by using switch and hold for a moment. If you give a sine wave or any analog signal, this switch, if I turn on this switch or uh, close this switch, what happened? This capacitor start charging. Then when switch is open, a turn of the switch, then capacitor discharge through the load. This is called as a sampling and hold circuit. This switch, it may be IJBT, it may be MOSFET, it may be your clock pulse, external clock pulse. So for that time, the capacitor will hold this, this analog signal and when it on off or the switch, then capacitor start discharge. So for that movement, here you can see it will it is charge capacitor hold for a moment again it discharge hold for a moment so it will give the discrete kind of signal then quantization what is mean by quantization is the process where the least significant bit determine if the input analog voltage lies in the lowest sub range of input voltage range the quantization means it converts that sample and hold circuit, sample and hold circuits output with some fixed digital value. In sample and hold circuit, they first sample the signal, then quantify it, it determine the resolution of signal and finally get the binary values and send it to the system to read the digital value. First it convert it into digital form and send it to the microcontroller and microprocessor for the further process. Here you can find out one analog signal is given and one analog signal is blue line is analog signal and this red waveform is digital form. For example, if I take uh, one example, two volt is V in its here ADC input is 2 volt. The resolution of ADC is 3 bit. That means how many levels it will give you or it will break the signal. This 2 volt will break into 2 raised to 3. That means it is equal to Eight. So this two volt zero two two will break with eight levels. So resolution is of three bits. Number of levels are eight. So your signal will divide into eight levels. The first range is of first range means at zero voltage it will show is zero 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 what about the higher value so the step size or difference between two level is here or i'll take this how to calculate this level this is nothing but your voltage level here the first zero zero will be zero voltage. The step size is how much? It is two fifty millivolt. How it comes? This two divided by eight it will give two fifty millivolt. So the difference between two value is 250 millivolt. If any range between 0 to 250 millivolt, 
will show 0 0 if input v in comes between any value of 0 to 250 it will give output 0 0 0 if it is above 250 the next step will be 250 to 500 millivolt it will give 0 0 1 it will give 0 0 1 so any value come between these two range it will give digital output 0 0 1 thank you student